this corner here, right in here, is actually when it's all said and done, and you can see it, you can actually see the shadow of the person even without the transfers here, is actually right here. You can see it, and, and it goes right here. Here's the body, here's the legs, comes on up and goes down. I know you gotta take some of these images out of the equation for you to see that type of work and, and, and imagination. You gotta have your art going. But here goes another deal that you're going to see that you're gonna say, are you kidding me? Uh, this guy's finding stuff out of his hat, but I'm not wearing a hat. It's a hot day today, huh? Hey, anyway, uh, let me just pull this. Look at all my x-rays, huh? Aren't they pretty? So, um, don't forget, um, let me show you also his other trick real quick. If you look at this hand, okay, you're going to say, okay, that's the hand of the woman that she's leaning, right? But what really gets trippy is if you take it and you turn it um, counterclockwise, okay, and then you open it up, the hand gives you a whole nother thought. It actually looks like somebody's palm in their hand with their thumb that's bent odd, and another hand from underneath the table is grabbing that hand kind of like um, tug of war in reverse or something or um, uh, something something's going on there that it's a real trip uh, so anyway I wanted you to see that but let me show you the other one that I wanted you to see which is of the um, uh, image in which um, uh, which was pretty exciting to see. I had to show it to my wife uh, that she says, oh my goodness, oh my goodness. Okay, so if it is, it is, it is. Here it is. I take this one, now open it. And it, it's pretty trippy if you, um, if, if, the way he's tricky. And so when you follow Leonardo da Vinci's works, um, you'll, uh, okay, you'll um, be pretty amazed on um, his works. Okay, so we're almost done here after this anyway. So um, I just want you to really know his tricks and I, I'm kind of like throwing all the eggs at the right uh, in the basket. So when you're looking at this image here, and you take it and you rotate it uh, 90 clockwise, you gives you a resemblance that the Mona Lisa fits in here. So then you grab the Mona. I slide this down in front of you, and you grab the Mona. And you put her up in here, and you reduce this down to fit the area. And you can see how he has her very well tucked in there, like right there. See? So he, he, and that means he is off the page. That means he's, he's, his head's off the page. Her head, if you get her when she moves across, can actually be sitting in the arm here. So that means somewhere in my painting is either got the skull here or in her hair. And I know for a fact if you take a look at my woman, she actually has a ribbon, and there's a couple like birds and eagles. If you take a look at the Mona here, she has the same ribbon, and she has the same birds in one of my YouTubes. So with all that, please, I hope you enjoyed it, and I want to say this for a fact, okay? It doesn't cost a dime to subscribe, is what I've been told. 
And if you can hit the thumbs up and the subscribe button, I would be extremely appreciative. And I show that you enjoyed it. I put many hours in there. And um, with that, I wish you guys stay at home and safe. And God bless the whole world, the universe, and the heavens. And you have a wonderful, wonderful night. Amen.